Hello everyone and welcome back to Gran Turismo 7. Welcome back to episode 22 of the series. In this episode, we're actually going to be taking it to the dirt. We're going to do some dirt races and we're going to do it in this Ford. Um, I just got this Ford off of uh, one of the races in the menu books. So you will get this Ford. And uh, yeah, so I'm going to be using it. We can we, we have two options. We can either use this Ford or we can use a Toyota. Uh, those both uh, we won. Uh, the Toyota you win earlier in one of the episodes. The Ford you win later on. But uh, I think this is actually one of... We are reaching the end. This is one of the last uh, menu books. So we haven't... We actually gone this far without really racing in the... In the um, in the dirt so this is going to be the first one which is interesting that they went this far which i get it this, this the game is not really heavy on like dirt races so I, I get that but honestly i if you're not going to go heavy on it i i don't know why they even include it but whatever at least we'll we didn't have to do it for the longest time and i think this is probably the only one that we'll have to do but uh, we'll see two laps we'll get this other car also a dirt car Let's see what happens. I personally don't like the dirt races because the, the controls are just way too difficult. Like you have to steer before the corner. Let's see. Like you see the corner coming up here, you have to like pretty much steer before the corner comes. It's, it's not easy, let me tell you that. And it's very slippery and it's like you're on ice basically. But I, I, we only need to get top three, so I'm hoping we just get that and just get uh, get out of here. You know what I mean? I guess the more you play it, you can get kind of used to it. I see the appeal in it, honestly, but I don't know. It's just not for me. It's all over the place. Like, look at our cars all over the place. You know what I mean? I guess it's the more fun stuff, like... Oh, uh, gotcha. Look, look at that. I'm not the best at dirt races, I'm not, that's something that I've gotta admit. Not my favorite, and I'm not the best at it, so... If you're good at it, it this could look beautiful, just like, drifting through the corner. Like. It could look beautiful, honestly, but it's not for me. All right, we're on to P7. It's literally a struggle. On to P6. We're actually doing not that bad. It's only two laps. It is a large like circuit, so... Is that a GTR? That's a dirt GD GTR, my friend. That's a rally GTR. What? The? I didn't even know these existed. That is literally GTR. Oh my god. It's actually not bad once you get the hang of it. That's the Toyota that we have. Up to P4. Just gotta beat this guy and I'm good. P3. See like right, that right there, that corner was nicely taken. Like see this corner coming up, you can drift through the whole thing, which is it's a that's a Mustang that, and then NSX. Are you kidding me? A Mustang rally car and then NSX rally car. Oh, that was actually beautiful. Nice. P1. Okay. Gotta maintain this. 
kind of getting the hang of it honestly it, it's not too too bad if you get if you get a hang of the corners just going around the corners will be much better obviously there are games that are based on this obviously dirt like dirt uh, five and six and those type of games are all like this so I just feel like Gran Turismo, if you're not gonna focus on it, why put it in? I just, that's my feelings. Having just one or two races, it's not... Like, either focus on it and keep it going throughout the game, or not have it at all. That's, that's what I think. It is fun, honestly. They did it pretty good. Pretty smooth. Oh my god. The car is like, you can't, it's so hard to control. See that? That was that, that corner right here was nice. How are we first? That's what I want to understand. You cannot tell me this performance is worthy of first place. Uh, I guess it is. <laughs> oh my god. Alright, you just gotta finish the lap, man. Just gotta finish the lap. See that corner right there? That's how you're supposed to take the corners. Turn ahead of it and just kind of drift through it like that. That's perfect. The problem is, can you do that in every corner? Some of the corners over there, they were nice, but not all of them. I want, I kind of want to drift through this whole corner. See if I could do it. Oh, I messed that up. Kind of let your nose in. Oh, okay, okay, okay. That was nice. That was nice. We still got it. Terrible driver in the dirt, but we still got it. <laughs> I'll take it. And we get one other uh, drift car. Let's see, is that one better than the one that we have? I like the Ford. They're kind of known for the drift rallies. Uh, this one is an Audi. Ridiculous wing on that. And bumper. Like, what is going on with this? What is going on with this wing? Let's see if it's much better than ours. So we did that one and then let's do the next one, which is in Italy, also a dirt race. So where's the one that we just got? It's actually 588 uh, horsepower. It looks like it's actually has to be 700 or less you know what i'm gonna well, why not just use it I, I we just need dirt tires so just put dirt tires on dirt tires on it and use it might as well use something new the car looks ridiculous but we're gonna try it Uh, the PP is way better than the one that we were using, the one, the Ford, so, you know, why not? Alright, let's go ahead and try it.
This one is five laps, so a little longer. But uh, yeah, it looks fun. Let's go. This wing is ridiculous. Like, what is this? Okay, okay, good start, good start. Like drifting the corner like this, when you when you when you do it like this smooth, it's actually fun. Like just drifting like that. Oh, that was nice. That was very nice. You drifting like that. Oh yeah. It's a lot of fun when you drift when you when you make when you make the corner. Like that was okay right there. When you go through the corner with a nice drift, nice and smooth. It's actually, it's actually a lot of fun. Oh my god. Alright, alright, alright. Keep it under control. Goodness. It's like my car is on ice. Got him all over the place. Okay, bro, what is going on? We're like stuck back here. Come on. We got stuck. We refueled, I guess. This is the side. We literally jumped into it. I didn't even mean to do that. Bro, get out of here. I need to get back up. It's actually not bad. Sorry, buddy. Come on, come on. I'm literally all over the place. Look, look at them. They're just like flying around. That Evo is nice, I'm not gonna lie. For the for the dirt races, that Evo. We're in first place. Somehow, somehow we ended up in first. I'll take it. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Alright, alright, we're good, we're good, we're good. Still first place. This is actually ridiculous. Why am I like... Nice, okay, okay, keep it up, don't go to the wall, keep it up, keep it up. It's okay. Okay. The potential is there. I... The, but... <laughs> And the idea is there, the execution is just sucks. In my head, in my, like I'm envisioning something, but I'm doing totally something else. Okay, that's not bad. That was terrible. I always get. I always go to that corner. Oh my god! They're coming. They're coming. Come on. I think I just need to ease off the throttle. To be honest, I'm pressing gas too much. I need to just focus a little bit more on the cornering. Just not too much. I'm pressing speed. Like, let's not. That wasn't too bad. Yeah, honestly, it's just 
the throttle maybe ease off. These jumps always mess you up, man. That was actually not bad right there. Okay. That was okay. All right, on to... We just gotta go through the stretch and that will finish this lab. We're actually doing not bad. Just let off the throttle and just ease it into the corner. That's the idea here. Okay, I, I, I think we're... It's alright. Not the worst. Okay, alright. We finished it. It is what it is. We did it, though. And we got another rally car. So now we've collected all three of them. And that's the menu book. I don't want to see it again. <laughs> Hopefully that's the only one we got to deal with. If there's a championship in, in the dirt, then that'll be a problem. Championships on their own are a headache. And then you throw in rally? No. Not a big fan. I, I guess it adds another, a little, um, you know, a, a break on, sometimes it can get too repetitive with the, with all the other cars. So it's just a nice curveball to do something different, which is, uh, I guess I can appreciate it. All right, Luca, this is number 37. He's going to tell us about these rally cars. Rallies are time trial races that take place on challenging roads, paved or otherwise. Here we have, uh, I, I can't pronounce this car's name, um, Bijouet or Bijouet. Uh, to be honest, I have no idea. 205 Turbo 16 Evolution 2 and the Audi Quattro S1 Pikes Peak. That's a, that's a ridiculous looking car. Both are legendary rally cars that reach the pinnacle of the sport. These days rallying is enjoyed all over the world, but do you know where it, uh, it all began? I mean, I can see the enjoyment, like being outside. I, I definitely can see the enjoyment. It has the origins in the Middle Ages, developing from a ritual where knights would rush back to their lords. Uh, modern modern rallying is an attempt to recreate this ritual in the automotive age. The world first ever automotive rally was the Monte Carlo rally in 1911. You're telling me this is a rally car. How is this going to How is this like on the dirt? Like I feel like these tires will fall off. Participants would set off from cities all over Europe and meet to meet or rally in Mon Monaco. Oh, that's cool. Okay, that's, what, that's how it started. Rallying soon spread across the entire continent and developed into the global motorsport we know today. Okay. 
I can honestly, I can see, I can see the appeal. The next collection is the Ferraris, which is nice. Okay, so I we did get a Ferrari from the last episode. Uh, let's open up the ticket. I don't think I'll go into the Ferraris. I'll just save it for a brand new episode. I think Ferraris deserve an episode on their own. So we'll do that on the next one. Open up this ticket and then uh, we'll call it a day. I mean, not a day, but we'll call it a wrap for this, uh, for this episode. Come on, man. Give me something good. There's three. Literally, I'll take three of those. Fine. That's fine. A lot of money. I'll take it. How much is this? 500k. Let's go. Nice. The first, first ever a proper actually ticket. All right. I think this is it. Uh, thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. Uh, please uh, just like the videos. That's all you have to do. And uh, that will help me so much. It gives me the motivation to create way more. Thank you guys for watching. And I'll catch you guys on the next one. Peace.